no be ele ni akona baba bless all the mama ya na mu di animal over the world it's joy and i want it you man oh yeah man I'm 
driver. Let me open that. Uh, open the trunk of the car. Are we there? Yes.
耶，啊耶，耶啊，是是，啦啦啦，是是是，啦啦啦啦，是是是，耶耶啊，是，啦啦耶耶啊，是，啦耶耶啊，是，啦啦。
Ea is not young. Ea is a grandmother. Nobody expect to live the eternity. But we thank God for her life. At 77, she was still strong, but she must go and visit our Baba God. Every one of us, oh God, that visitation, one day we will be there. So as you are here, I want you to be free. I want you to be happy. We are not crying, but we are rejoicing. Because the old woman has been in the presence of God and died in the presence of God. So as you come and join us, may God bless you in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Somebody shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. You are the Lord of my soul. Our Father God, you are worthy to be praised. In our generation, there is no one like you. Our Father God, you are worthy to be praised. Thank you, thank you, Jesus. You are the owner of my soul. Our Father God, you are worthy to be praised.
Praise the Lord. Give a clap offering to yourself. Amen. Then give a clap offering to the Almighty. Hallelujah. The man who has sustained you to this hour. Thank you, Jesus. Who gave you rain free of charge? The man who gave you free air. The man who gave you free life. Thank you, Jesus. If you are to pay, you cannot pay. That's all. If Nepal was to be in charge of sun, hey. you will be in darkness. That's all. If they don't want the world was to be in charge of rain, ah. hungry go kill us. That's all. That is why he is bigger than the biggest. Yes. He is better than the best. Yes, sir. He is heavier than the heaviest. Yes, sir. He is love. No man can count him. Yes, sir. Celebrate Jesus once more. Thank you, Jesus. May God bless you. We are going to go straight. Please. Amen. Praise Master Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. My reading is taken from Revelation chapter 14, 12 to 13. Here is the patience of the saints. Here are they that keep the commandments of God and the faith of Jesus. Verse 13. And I heard a voice from heaven saying unto me, Right, blessed are the dead which die in the Lord from end forth, yea, says the Spirit that they may rest from their neighbors, and their works to follow them. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Celebrate Jesus. God bless you, our sister. We are going to go to the first hymn. When the roll is called up yonder. When the trumpet of the Lord shall sound on the morn, it's eternal bright affair. When the when the silver bell shall gather over on the others, and the road is all of yonder, I will be there. When the road.
For to this end, Christ who died and rose, and received that he might be the Lord, both of the dead and the living. Then it says, But why dost thou judge thy brother? Or why dost thou set at not thy brother? For we shall all stand before the judgment seat of Christ. Eleven it says, For it is written, As I live, said the Lord, Every knee shall bow to me, and every tongue shall confess to God. Twelve, the last verse, so then every one of us shall give account of himself to God. Amen. Amen. I so much love this Roman 14 7. Every one of you sitting down here, whether you be witch or you be wizard, Baba, native doctor, pastor, evangelist, and all the other way, you will stand and you will be judged. If you do anything in secret, he's watching you. If you do it openly, he's watching you. But the only place you cannot escape, you can run to Germany to go and hide. But six feet is waiting for you. Praise the Lord. So we are going straight away to the second hymn, Fading Away. Fading away.
say cheat. If you are a husband snatcher, you will be known as a husband snatcher. That woman, when they carry people, husband don't die. May you not be record with what you have done wrongly. Amen. And so shall it be. Amen. Straight away, we are going to the third Bible reading, taken from the book of Revelation 21, verse 3 to 7. I call on the Apostle Charles to take that. Praise the Lord. Let the living soul shout hallelujah. hallelujah. Are you sad? No. If you know you are not sad, shout a living hallelujah to the Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. My reading is taken from Revelation 21, verse 3 to 7. I read. And I heard a great voice out of heaven saying, Behold, the tabernacle of God is with men, and he will dwell with them, and they shall be his people. And God himself shall be with them, and be their, and be their God. In verse 4, And God shall wipe away all tears from their eyes, and there shall be no more death, neither sorrow, nor crying, neither shall there be any more pain. For the former things are passed away. In verse 5, And he that sat upon the throne said, Behold, I make all things new. And he said unto me, Write, for these words are true and faithful. In verse 6, And he said unto me, It is done. I am Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end. And we give unto him that is a test of the fountain of the water of life freely. The seven, the last verse, He that overcometh shall inherit all things, and I will be his God, and he shall be my son. The Lord bless his will in Jesus' name. Amen. Celebrate Jesus, somebody. We are going to go straight to the third hymn. Blessed assurance. You see that on page 4-2. I hand over the choir. Blessed assurance, Jesus is mine. Oh, what a fountain for glory divine. Air of salvation. Oh, 
Father of all, a.k.a. Mama Ben, a Ben. Somebody shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. On behalf of my family, on behalf of my lovely brother, Mr. Benjamin Osaradin, put your hands together for Jesus. I am taking this biography. Dignity B6 patience. Osaradin was born. Was born 77 years ago in 1945 to 2022 into the family of Ohomina in Ituanfua Itunga village in the local government area of Edo State. She grew up morally and beautifully with her parents, Mr. and Mrs. Ohomina, but lost her father when she was a kid. In an ego, she relocated to her home village where she was raised by her aunt, Mrs. Eganrua. There, she attended her home primary school between 1951 to 1957. After she went into tailoring and learned a trade of her, of her lovely aunt, Miss Patience. Ohomina, married in 1966 to Mr. Puli Osarete, where she lived happily with her husband. She gave birth to 10 children and survived with 8 children, 20 grandchildren, whose birth and citizenship can be traced to foreign nations and also in Nigeria. When she got married, she forgot trading as a occupation alongside a successful farmer who knew the time to plant and harvest. Mrs. Patient of Amina, Eko Makoma Osarete, was a was caring, was a caring mother to all, a good housewife who always ensure her children and others are never hungry. Not only that, she ensures anyone who calls on her has what they needed. Her strength was seafood, burger, crayfish, brown, brown stockfish, etc. Selling in the popular Osa market to make sure the children's food is always on the table. Mrs. Patient, Ekoma Koma Osaretin, is incomparable and unforgettable because she became born again Christ believer, Christ believer in 1999 baptized in 2008 and served in various capacity in Christ choosing church of God as a deaconess let Mrs. Patience popularly called Iye Ben Naben is an Esteem mother with passion for truth, generous in kindness, and was loved by all. We are lucky and blessed to have Mrs. Patient Ekomakoma Osaretin as a mother. Mom, we miss you. We will always remain in our heart. Oja Mama, sign for the children. Praise Master Jesus. Hallelujah. I want somebody to put your hands together for my late mother, a wonderful and a unique mother. Celebrate her for me, please. That's so. That's a celebrate mother. No secret. That's so. You see, he has praised the mother. I don't know the type of mother you be. I know say good to our mama no good. When our mama don't go, we say it goes. But you know, say don't panic, beat you well, well. Correct you. That's what makes her a great mother. Not those who pamper their children to become a spoiled child. They're going to terrorize people for roots. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. If you are a good mother, your child will not be a terrorist. Amen. And so Mrs. Deconis was a good mother who sell crayfish. At the summer market to make sure the children survive. 
He did not sell anything. Go to some market. Go and learn how to sell the fish. So, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I said, praise the Lord, somebody. Hallelujah. I just want to let you know, so the fish thing, they cause people to go far and build houses, buy cars and buy land. So, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. It's the reality of life. The book of the Hebrews, the book of Genesis, we saw the creation of man. The book of Genesis began with God and it ended with coffee. For the meeting of your father and your mother that gave birth to you, it is God that brought you and you are expected to continue in the Lord because one day you will end up in that coffee. What will you be remembered? We can live like this. She was a mother to all, very calm. And that is one attitude that every mother ought to have. A mother, you are a mother not only your children, to as many that you have contact with. And if you are a mother, you are only a mother to your children. You are definitely mistaken. There is a lot you need to do. Now, because of the way this woman is, that is why they decided to honor her. You that is sitting down here, can't go say you don't die. When people say, ah, this good woman has gone. Now we are celebrating her passing. You that is sitting down, take this word and take it home. There is time for everything. You that is young, drinking alcohol, smoking it go, a time we call you will be old. And you will lie down strong death. Take that message home. We God say concerning you. Saint Augustine, a Catholic bishop, wrote in his book for a title confession. He said, we as students of God, we are made for God. He said, our spirit and soul, our heart is restless until we rest in the Lord. That is why you need to know, if you are not a child of God, your heart is restless. You are running from pillar to pillar. You are moving from here and there. You do not have peace in your heart because everything is in, in the constitution here to you. It is only when you are in Christ, it is only Christ that will give you eternal peace. And Christ is calling each and every one of us today. He told us in his book, in Matthew 11, house. And we are in hurry to make this money. Not thinking whether the path is the right path to make that money. Let the ministers gather around there. Please, put down on your knees. Please begin to come in this one into the hands of God. Open your mouth and commit them into the hands of God. The Father has left them behind. They are not alone. Because God is with them. Come the Father into the hands of God. In Jesus' name. Amen. Father Lord, these are the children of society. Father Lord, they are in your hands. Father Lord, you told us that you are the father to the fatherless. Amen. And you are the mother to the motherless. Father Lord, be their mother. Amen. Be their father. Amen. Father, any man in you here that will rise, to say he wants to bring these ones down because their parents, their mother is no longer here. Father Lord, bring that one down. Amen. Any man that will cause this one, Father, that one is cursed. And any man that will bless them, that one is blessed. Amen. Father Lord, carry them on your wings. Amen. Father Lord, guide and protect them. Amen. Be their God. Amen. Be their all. Amen. In Jesus' name we are praying. Amen. 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 It is settled. Glory be to God. Daniel, the King of Kings. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praising the Lord. Oh,